What's going on YouTube? This is Mike from MTG Vintage Crack and I'm going to be playing a little bit of Arena today. I've been working on this deck for a little while now. It's just a Guilds of Ravnica standard mono red burn deck. It's got Banefires, Shocks, Lightning Strikes, Wizards Lightnings, and Pyromancers which uh, kind of just let us throw damage straight at our opponents faced. Wizard's Lightning does get the Wizard's Cost Reduction from both the Ashino Pyromancer as well as the Lava Runner. Rekindling Phoenix is a nice threat in this deck and a recurring one at that. You'll need two removal, basically two removal spells or an exile spell to get rid of it. And then finally we are also running four Risk Factors, which actually tends to put a lot of work in this deck. So with that being said, let's check it out. All right, here we go. Okay, this is a pretty decent hand. We've got one removal spell. Uh, we've got a Pyromancer. And as long as we can get another land, we can cast the rest of it. Which in this case, the rest of it is really just the uh, risk factor, because once the Pyromancer is down, Wizard Lightning only costs one red. Guess I should have cast the Shivan Fire in response. Just basically trying to poke some damage on the as I can. Poison Tip Archer can get pretty annoying, um, did really well with it in a pre-release. I think we just need to pop it now. I guess I could have done that beforehand as well. So in this case, I actually don't want the Flame of Kelp. Hoping for another land. There it is. Actually, we could second main the Phoenix and the Pyromancer instead of the playing the risk factor.
and that'll bring the steam can back up to uh, three anyway. I, I guess I should have attacked. I don't know why I didn't. I guess afraid that they might have some sort of combat trick that kills it and takes away the counters. And you can't either of the creatures. So hopefully opponent can't keep up with this. Plus next turn we're probably playing a risk factor. Well, that sucks. We'll have to hope this guy stays protected through the next turn. That's a really good thing about Rekindling Phoenix, is it really allows you to... Oh, this opponent couldn't keep up. Awesome. 